Hello guys, welcome to you. In this video, we are going to see how to download and install Ipsen L3115 printer driver in a Windows 7 PC or laptop. It is a very easy and simple process. So let's go to our video. First go to the our PC and check our machine is 32 bit or 64 bit. That is very easy. Go to the computer, right click on the computer, click on the properties, click on the properties. In properties, find system type. If system type is 64 bit, then that machine is 64 bit operating system machine. If system type is 32 bit, that means that machine is 32 bit operating system machine. This machine is 32 bit operating system machine. Close it. After that, we are going to download the, our drivers. Go to the any web browser that you like. I am going to the Google Chrome. Here type Ipsen L3115 driver and hit enter key on your keyboard. First link is from the Ipsen. Open the first link. Here we find official website of the Ipsen L3115 and it's showing this is a model or the series of L3110. L3110 is the series of the our Ipsen L3115. It's download the L3110 series printer driver. It's saying that. Scroll down and here we find downloads. Here we find please choose an OS operating system. Click at here. And if your machine is 32 bit, then go to the Windows 7 32 bit. If your machine is 64 bit, then go to the Windows 7 64 bit. My machine is 32 bit. So I click on the Windows 7 32 bit. Click on the your machine, machine Windows 7 and your bit. Click at here and click on the go. And it's refresh your page. It's take few seconds. And here we find L3110. It is a series of the our L3115 printer. First is the printer driver and second is the scanner driver. First I download the scanner driver. I go to the here download. Click on here or right click on it and click on open in a new tab. And in new tab new new file or new website is open. Click at here accept. And our download is started at here. It's take few seconds. So be a patient and wait for a few seconds to scan a driver's download. Wait for a few seconds. Our download is completed now. Go to the show all. Show in a folder. Minimize it. Drag this setup file to desktop. This is our scanner driver. Close it. Next option is go to the download web browser once again. And close it. Close this. And go to the your main page. And here we find printer driver. Click on this printer driver now, redirect to the another page, click on accept and our download is started. It's take few seconds or few minutes depending on the speed of your internet. Click on the show all, show in a folder, minimize it, drag this to desktop. Here is the our printer driver, here is the our scanner driver and we are going to unzip this G file. This setup file is actually a G file and we are going to extract it, right click on it. Click on extract here and here we find our file, double click on it, folder, here we find 86 if your machine is 32 bit, if your machine is 64 and here we find 64, double click on this folder and here is the our driver setup file or the our setup files, close it and we are going to install it manually that is very easy and simple, go to the start, click on the control panel. In a control panel, find devices and printers. Click on devices and printers. In devices and printer, we find add a printer option. Click on this add a printer option two time. Minimize it. Here we find add a printer options. In a add a printer option, click on add a local printer. Click on add a local printer. Here we find existing port. And here we find port. Click on this port and find any USB port, USB 001, 002, 003, 004, 005, select any USB port that you want, select the, your USB port, click on the next. Here we find have a disk, click on have a disk, click on browse, click on the desktop, our drivers are on desktop, here we find our folder, double click on our folder, click on your folder, here we find setup file, this is the our driver files and click on the any file that you want. Here, here, click on any file, click on open, click on OK. Here we find Ipsen L3110 series. It is a series of the L31100. So it's showing and it is the series or the printer is Ipsen L3115. And here we find one problem. This driver is not digitally signed. These drivers are not digitally signed for the our Windows 7. This is not a big problem. We got one error and we solve this error in the next step. Click on the next. 
here we find our printer it is a series printer so change it to the any name i change it to the l3115 select rename with the any name and click on the next it's installing our printer it's take few seconds and we find one error we find do not install this driver software or install this software anyway i want to install it so i click on install this software anyway it takes few minutes our printer is now installed if you want to print a test page then click on a printer test page or click on the finish after that we just go to the our start and check our printer is properly installed or not go to the start here we find control panel click on the control panel in control panel go to the devices and printers click on devices and printers and if you find your printer epson l3115 at here that means this printer is properly installed in windows 7 pc or laptop so guys thank you for watching this video don't forget to like share comment on this video and don't forget to subscribe the channel thank you guys